If you want to buy cheap and reliable Ultimate Team FIFA coins, then go to fifacoinszone.com. What is up guys, I'm Tom LFC Avenue and welcome to a brand new Liverpool Carrier Mode episode. And guys, I'm recording this just before the Liverpool Man City game and I will do live reactions during the game. And also I will do a match review and reaction video after it. This is a huge, huge game. The 25th anniversary of the Hillsborough disaster is very, very close. I will make a tribute video. Um, and the justice for the 96th video on Tuesday uh, but now all I have to say is uh, you will never walk alone and we will never forget uh, the the Hillsborough disaster and just uh, watch what Enfield will do in tribute to them and it was so nice to see all the all the country up and down uh, England playing paying their tributes uh, yesterday it was really, really emotional, and uh, this is uh, how the league table looks like. And um, we are playing away at Newcastle. We have one point behind Chelsea, and uh, Newcastle are third. So this will be a very, very difficult game. Don't make no mistake about it. Newcastle knocked us out of the FA Cup, I think, last season. So I have to be absolutely 100% on my game if I want to win this. Let's go, guys! What a massive game this is, guys. Newcastle against Liverpool at one of my favorite grounds in England, the St. James's Park. There is always a cracking atmosphere. We are one point behind Chelsea and we have a worse goal difference, so every single goal counts. And hopefully we can start banging in the goals. In the past few games I really struggled to score many goals. I could only score uh, one goal against Fulham in the FA Cup semi-final. One goal against Reading at home. Hopefully, we can score a couple and win the game comfortably. Let's go, guys! Against Reading, they finished one nil. It's quite a close run affair. Montoya! Oh my God! Oh my God! What a finish! What a goal by Montoya! This is amazing. The right back goes on a mad one and unleashes an absolute cracker into the top far corner. Are you kidding me? What a start by Liverpool. What a finish. Take a bow, son. Oh my word. This is a huge goal in the title race. That's a cracking finish. No goalkeeper is saving that. Oh, go on, Shakiri. Must finish. Oh no! Oh my god, Shakiri, how did you not score that? Ah, uh, it's on his favorite left foot. Unbelievable. Oh, great save, Muslera. Rory, oh, no! How did you not? Oh, Royce is such a good finisher. He only missed the target there by a whisker. We should be free nil up at least, guys. But Newcastle had some good chances. Look at the possession, man. We are dominating here. Oh, great save, Muslera. Ah, Newcastle are threatening now. Come on, Montoya. Finish it! Yes! Yes! Sturridge! Got in! Whoa, what a glitch that is! Got in! Huge goal! Montoya's shot is saved, but Sturridge is there to tuck in the rebound. A vital, vital goal that could see us win the game. We are 2 0 up now. Got in, guys! Let's make three substitutions, and I also changed the formation. So, uh, Van der Heyden, Uchan, and Henderson coming on, and this will be the formation. I really need to solidify uh, the midfield and guys let me know what is your favorite formation in the game in career more in career mode and online let me know in the comments below online this is my favorite formation because it 
it gives a defensive steal on carrier mode i like to attack all the time so let me know guys in the comments below what is your favorite formation no oh what a save musleva that's huge yes what a massive win guys we beat the third place team newcastle so basically that that already is certain that we feel we will finish at least second in the season but i really want to win the title guys Sturridge and montoya with the goals and i kept the ball really well created more chances and uh, when uh, musley was, was called upon he made some brilliant terrific saves oh no mama dusako wants me to sell him he wants to go on the transfer list as soon as possible it's great that uh, Rafael Varane is coming in July on a pre-contract agreement because Sako, uh, I, I, I will try to keep him but he, you know, the board might for force my hand. So now let's look at the results before we go on to our next game and uh, Chelsea, um, wait, let me skip, let me scroll down there. So uh, Chelsea beat Bolton 4-0. Oh, damn. Wow, their goal difference is now much better than ours, even though I won 2 0. So, I guess we just have to beat them in the last game of the season. There is five, game left, five games left in the league. This is such an exciting title race, just like in real life. Our next game is at home against Watford. It, as it's a, a home banker. And I bring in Ilori. I bench Sako because, uh, you know, there is only five games left of the season in the league. And he, he goes on to say that he wants to leave in the summer. That's just out of order. So I, I bench him for this game. Hopefully that will teach him a lesson and he will come back more committed to the cause. Raheem Sterling also comes in. Uh, Royce moves up to the camp because Martial was really tired. So I don't want to, I want to avoid uh, him getting injured. So let's play Watford at home, guys. Must win game. And Chelsea are playing Queen's Park Rangers. Hopefully QPR can do us a massive favor here. Let's go. I think the title race will go down to the wire, guys. Let me know what was your closest title race in carrier mode when you were playing uh, carrier mode. Because, you know, there is only five games left and Chelsea have some easy games before they come to Anfield so it come it could come down to the last game of the season that could be vital if we beat Chelsea in the last game and win all our own other games we win the title so the good thing is we have the title in our hands just like Liverpool in real life so let's try and win all our games remaining and hopefully then we can lift the title let's go guys Come on, Suarez, no! Oh, no! Go on, Sterling. All the way. All the way! That's a penalty. Oh, my word. Ref. Seriously? Go on, Sturridge. Underestimating the opposition. Possibly. As long as their is on form Suarez! Ah, oh, no! Oh, he's just... Shakiri! Finish it! Yes! Yes! Finally! Share on Shakiri! Come on, mashing on your teammates! Ha <laughs> ha! Lovely celebration! We got really lucky because the first shot is blocked, but the second one is good. Between the defender's legs. Shardan Shakiri. He missed some good chances in the previous game. But now he scores. Come on, guys. Huge game. Must beat. Must beat Watford. Royce? Oh, no. What a safe goalie. Rahim? No way. How did he save that? Raheem Sterling, you should have scored, man. Come on, Sterling, must finish. Oh, oh, oh what a goal! Raheem Sterling sees the game. A brilliant, 
Ronaldo chop to get past the defender and then he unleashes an absolute corker into the top corner. That's a lovely goal. Brilliant weighty fast, look at that skill and then that finish is just top top class. I sensed that this could be a game for Raheem Sterling and he delivers. Lovely lovely goal, look at that. Take a bow, Go, no goalkeeper is saving that, that's brilliant. Let's make uh, three substitutions, Martial, Uchan and Malanda coming on and we change the formation once again to control the game and see it out. So this will be the formation that I'm rocking with, let's go! Oh my word! Who must play a good save? Oh my god! How did he miss that? Wow, we got him so, so lucky. He just basically skips past all the challenges and then he misses it. No way. No way! Oh my days. Fab Fabrini scores a cracking goal. And to be honest, Watford played really well in the last like 20, 25 minutes. That's a cracking goal. Damn it, we must hold on guys, it's the 94th minute or something like that, we must hold on. Yes guys, we have won another game, we are now only 4 games away from the title. But it was a really nervy game, especially the ending after that Fabrini 94th minute goal. But it was just a consolation and all in all I deserved it, I had more chances than Watford. But they, they kept the ball really well in this game. So, wow, great episode, two wins, let's see Chelsea's result. So these are the latest Premier League results and Chelsea just keep on winning. Against Chris Pagrejas they won 2-1 and uh, let's see the league table before we end this great episode. Chelsea have a better goal difference, they have a plus 55 goal difference, I have a plus 50 goal difference, which to be honest is really, really good, but <laughs> Chelsea are just, look at that, 87 points from 34 games, normally you win a title with 87 points, but we might have to get, how many, 86 plus 12, that's 98, we need, we might need 98 points to win the league. That shows how absolutely insanely good Chelsea have been this season. But we are keeping pace with them, which is just brilliant. Let's see the top scorers in the league. Cavani overtake, have overtaken Suarez and Sturridge. He, he has been the main man for Chelsea. So Cavani is first, Suarez and Sturridge is second and third in the league. But in the top scorers chart... Uh, the top five, uh, four Liverpool players in the top five. So thanks for watching, guys. I'm now off to plot, watch the Liverpool Man City game and edit this video. Like the video if you are enjoying this series and want to see a second episode uploaded later today. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a nice day. Goodbye. So let's see what the side, guys. Wow. On FIFA 15, I hope they will show Anfield from the area of view as well because. That's just an absolutely beautiful, beautiful sight.